So guys, first day here in Sydney and new roommate, Merkel. First name Merkel? Not really, his uh, name is Michael, but if you guys want to know how we got the name Merkel, head over to his Instagram and ask him. It's a good story. I'm sure he'd love to tell you. I've been wondering that for ages. I've seen Merkel online all the time and I'm like, it can't be his real name, but what is the story behind it? And last night I found out. You guys got to check him out. Um, but... He cried when I told him. <laughs> yeah, I did cry. It was actually very emotional. I couldn't believe it. Um, but we got in last night. He actually flew in um, like after a full day traveling from Ohio, correct? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's good. 22 hours. Yeah, yeah, 22 hours, and then he was like still awake by the time I got, I got here, which I was I was shocked about. So um, so we what do we do? We chilled, got some sushi, yeah, and uh, stocked this place up. EHP sent us some some like goodies here, or is it whole bag of protein bars? You already ate yours, though, didn't you? Yeah, we saved the tip for him, so. And we stocked the place up because you guys know that I have to I have to get that done. So this is what we're dealing with here. This is like a late night shop, spur of the moment type thing. All the meats we have to we do have to cook these at some point. I think the the chicken and turkeys. We've got a lot of animals here. We've got salmon chicken and turkey and then all the veg eggs good and a couple softs EHP sent us that which is good I got some potatoes because I'm weird and this is yours up here is it no <laughs> empty cupboard oh, yeah. <laughs> That's yours. Yeah. here we go here we go Sweet, sweet carbs. They don't have honey nuts. Yeah, we were saying. We don't have that here, I don't they think. They probably don't even know what I'm talking about. But they can guess. I have a lot of US guys too, okay. so they'd know okay. what you're talking about. So they at least know the honey nut. Like, yeah. Man, the other guys are missing out. We're actually missing out hard. So I'm guessing like honey nut could be similar to crunchy nut. I don't know. But I don't think we have it because I've seen it on your stories and it looks goddamn delicious. Yeah. And we're, it's life. It's every day. we're seriously missing out hard here. Um, but these apartments are pretty sick. I'm pretty stoked with what they've sorted us out here. Because at least we can cook, which we're planning to do. We're going to make some breakfast now. What are you making? I'm going to do some eggs, a little bit of oats, some yogurt. Some yeah. Basic. Delish. I'm going to do it. Poverty omelette. <laughs> and uh, and then today is today is my day off because I need to really sort myself out. Especially after that last video when I told you guys how cooked my body is at the moment. I'm going to try rest as much as possible. So I'm going to try have another rest day today, the second day in a row. And uh, we're going to go down to EHP HQ. Go check it out, get our gym passes as well. See the guys there, so I'll bring you along. And I also want to get a haircut and buy some shoes, potentially. We get some shoes? Yeah, definitely some shoe shopping. Get some shoe shopping. And I've booked a massage randomly, like I did last night for like 2 p.m. today. So I've got all that to squeeze into one day because we're going to get ready for the expo. So I can't rock up to the expo with my hair like this and with my back all snapped up like it is <laughs> and with no shoes on. <laughs> so it's like, we got to be clean. We're going to do it. Yeah, we got to. But first we've got to eat because I'm actually getting pretty hungry. Same. Let's do it. I'm gonna try to vlog and cook at the same time. Um, yeah, I'm gonna see how this works. Evan, I'm gonna chuck some of this on there because this combo is just like, shit. you haven't even had this before, have you? No. Perinase, you gotta put that in your oats. To proof here, guys, um, we've been trying to work this stove and evidently this, like, it doesn't work. Like, we're pretty much gassing ourselves in here. So if this, if this um, whole place blows up, it is not our fault. Um, but it's, it was actually quite scary. This is what we're dealing with here. Please don't fall in the bin. Okay, that pan is just horrendous. So on the way to the EHP offices, hopefully we can get some new samples of the, the new Oxy Shred, which would be sick. Um, we're just talking about these sunnies as well. Wait, Merk, you got your sunnies on? Yeah. Yeah. Here, where, where did you get them? Because they're actually fire. Oh, sorry. Actually, first yeah, I, I want to... Um, I've been talking about these ones as well, because he's been asking me where I got mine. And, um, and it's, uh, I think I'm finally ready to tell you guys where I got him from. I got Oh shit, here we hey, go. Hey, hey, hold on. Oh, yo, it's Max. We, we actually found it. That's what's up. Okay, so we made it. I'm hoping that we can um, try some new Oxy Shred samples. God. Would you shut up? I'm trying to vlog here. Trucks. No respect. Um, but I was just saying, Merck's got some sick shades. That are, oh, Merck, tell them where you got the sunnies from. Um, so I got them from, um... Actually, let's just go inside first, because I think we better get in here. So it is time to, to be tourists. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be a tourist. Merv wants to take a photo in front of this, um, this sick view, so I'm going to try try to sort something out. Um, maybe get somebody to take one of us. We can try yeah, that as well. Yeah. A little couple goals. <laughs> couple goals, yeah. Um, but it's always nice to be a tourist in here. That's going to be that's going to be me. I'm going to be getting the angles. That's Merk over there. Yeah. He's got this like it's a it's a proper stance. 
Yeah. yeah. Have one foot at about you know, 100, He's good. 170 degrees, the other one at a 90. Yeah, what's the, what's the angle of the feet? It's about a, you, know, you create about an 85 degree angle, you know, not 90. 90 and there's a bit of a foot. tilt too with the legs, yeah. lean. That's going to be me taking this shot for Merck right now. It's all about the angles, guys. If you want to, if you want to take the perfect shot, it's all about the angles. <laughs> Should we try and get it? Let's do it. <laughs> yeah. Let's literally we create we'll, it. We'll try and get it. Yeah. Just the, the quickest way, please. No mad rush for this haircut. We took those photos, I think it was pretty successful. Yeah. 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 Merck's um, getting the model shot. I'll, put, I'll see if I can put some in here. Flick them in. I, I hope there's ones that that girl took turn out okay. Yeah. We asked her to take the photos. What and, uh... tweaked me out is she started laughing and then talking in like Chinese. Oh really? Yeah, so I'm a little nervous. <laughs> I, say, I did say thank you in Chinese yeah. to her. I think she appreciates it. She's here. Um, but this hair needs to get sorted because this is like this is way too long, and especially by Merck standards. That's like a zero fade that's about two that's days old. McCoy and it's already too long. I'd say about that's about 43 hours old. I mean, and maybe mm. I can get the top of mine curled like yours as well. I'll just perm the top of my head. And then we can roll the exact same guy. I'll die apply. Yeah. Merc 1 and 2. Yeah, we, they might, they'll probably work. call you Merc 1, so it's a little... Maybe I'll be Michael. This is crazy. It's like literally in the department yeah. store. In the store. So good. Thank you. You're very welcome. So, so. Get your little 360. It's the confidence cuts. Yeah, they're the key. Confidence they're key. That actually looks really crisp. Yeah. 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 Haircut pumps. Is it a big haircut pump? Uh, I think it is now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So the hair is cut. A lot better. Confidence cuts. I feel like a new person. But it is time for Nando's now because uh, Merck still hasn't had Nando's yet. And I think it's my civic duty as an Australian to give him the Nando's required. Even though it's not as good as the UK, he's never had it, so it's gotta be done. Are you ready, Mo? You know, it's been a first time for a lot of things, so. Let's do it. Let's do it. So we got the pita with the salad, which is normal for me. I'm gonna grab one of these, man. It's good. Mm. It's like Cajun or something. Yeah, it's good. That's really good. That chicken will be the best. So that's one thing about Nando's, always reliable. Reliable for good macros, a good feed, and the chicken is just, it's too good. So, can't go wrong. How sick is this? So nice. Definitely feels like 1700 bucks. So guys, this was stop one, sneak boy. Uh, personal favorite of mine, and Merck just got the sickest photos of shoes that <laughs> he's yeah. ever got. You make me nervous because I'm like, if I just bought something I didn't know about, I'm scared. Yeah, he was he wasn't committed yet, and no. I didn't think it through because like these don't really have shoes that we can afford at this point in time um, because they're all minimum like thousand dollars. Yeah, that's um, not like Fendi, but which, that's the and that's like, not on your, that's not on the, our budget right now. Like, that's, not my, that's not even on my radar to put on my feet. Like no, <laughs> my feet do not deserve that yet. Like no, no, no. But uh, we're gonna try find another joint that's a little bit uh, more affordable for us. But it was still cool to see because they have some sick shoes in there. I'm buying for a shoe. I like him. I think we're on, we're on the money here. This could be a thing. Even though it's got no soul. You know, I'll take it. <laughs> Come home, you know what I'm saying? No, that's I, sleek I though. That is thing. sleek. Yeah. Let's try some sizes. Yeah. yeah, this is a feed and a half, for sure. So guys, that is a wrap for today. I feel like we had the busiest day today. We got everything done that I wanted to get done. Haircut, check, shoes, over there. Back getting snapped up, crack. And also, um, food. Yeah, we got a little bit more extra food because uh, Merck hadn't had any, hadn't had Kinder Bueno before and I was like, man, this is my favorite chocolate of all time. Big fan? Big fan. Yeah, yeah loves yeah, it. Yeah. Who doesn't love Kinder Bueno? Yeah. I mean, like if I had to choose one, I'd definitely be Kinder. Um, but plan for tomorrow, I think we're getting up. My, uh, we're doing yoga at 10, I think, for some weird reason. Um, it's Broga. gonna suck. Broga. Yeah, Broga. Me and Merck, I think, Max. Yako and Max. So we'll see how that goes. Interesting, and then uh, we're gonna hit a juicy, juicy shoulder workout, yeah? Yeah, no, yeah. It's gonna be so we'll take you guys through it. Anyway, it's time to just um, crash, finish these chockies, and see in the morning to get our stretch on. Good morning, guys. So it is time for the yogas. Me and hashtag Murky. Hashtag Murk. I'm ready. Any Stormzy fans out there, um, please explain why he hashtags Murky. I was trying to explain it, but I don't know why. So um, anyway, he just thinks it's a cute nickname. Murky. We'll talk about me about hashtag Murky. But yeah, we got yoga today with the guys. So uh, I don't really, I'm not a huge fan of yoga. The last one I did was with Dave and it was hot yoga and it was sickening and it made me real uncomfortable and it just reminds me how 
unflexible I am as a human being. So yeah, I'm just looking to survive this. <laughs> yeah, honestly. same. But yeah. it's only 30 minutes, which is good. So um, I'll be curious to see how Yako and Max go as well. How are you, mate? How are you? you good. Are. You ready to get stretched? <laughs> <laughs> I just told him I can't even touch my toes. Good! <laughs> See, okay. so, as I was saying, my money wasn't on Yako to be the most flexible. I think, I, I guess, I guess it means you were going to be the worst. They're going to tell us to put our feet on our head and we're going to roll out of here. Yeah. 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 Just, um, update guys, just finished up the yoga. And it was difficult. So all done now. How'd you find it? Yeah, no, that was brutal. That yeah, was brutal. yeah. Breathing, they were like breathe, and then you couldn't even breathe with their, you know, they were. And it should be like, okay, breaths. now breathe out. I'm like, I've got nothing left. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Hold it. Oh, just like, like a two breath hold was about five minutes. Yeah, I don't, so I don't understand that. Yeah, uh, but, but my back, that actually that fixed it. Like, it loosened up my back a lot. I find as well, which which is good. But it, I was saying it hurts the triceps. It really hurts the shoulders. Just hold that hold like that tension. Yeah, and if your hips are tight, like my Which hips are tight. Too. Yeah, yeah that. that was that was tough. But um, but overall, that was that was good. I yeah, feel I feel yeah, good now at least. Yeah. Now that is a pre-workout meal if I've ever seen one. Just don't look at the, all this shit because it's actually it's a little bit messy. I told Murky I was cooking up a feast. So this is our pre-workout meal. I think we've got about 60 grams worth of carbs from rice here, some Nando's chicken, best, and <laughs> some uh, some diced veggies because I love my veg and Merck doesn't eat any. So I said, let me cook it for you. It's gonna taste mint. I use, do you use a little bit of L-carnitine? Jesus. Uh, when I remember, yeah. Okay, yeah, I like it for the... Do you find a good focus? Uh, I use it, so they say it helps with fat metabolism. Yeah. Uh, so that's what I use it for. I usually, the serving size is one, one gram. Which it is. Two. I usually put in like, I recommend like three to four grams. Literally with the, um, as you'll soon see, Murky, every time I take like any kind of pre or like vasodilator, I always get red as hell. Like I will get, like I'm like pretty red now, which is eight, hot, but the all the like stimulants or whatever, super red. And if I take up, if I take RP Max, yeah, it gets me, it gets me really nice. So um, I might not have that now. That's why I like Oxy because it's like really clean energy as well. Yeah, I don't get the tingles, like scratching my eyeballs out, which is um. Some people love it. I don't know, but for me, I'm I'm just a little bitch. I think so. I think I'll have the oxy with the psi. That's just my go-to, and a bit of soy, and also a little bit of um, rice wine vinegar. Do you do that you in your press? Cumin in there too. <laughs> yeah, put some cumin like, in there. Yeah. Um, we got a whole stick of butter right here. We're gonna just throw that in there. Do you have a tub of butter and a tub of carnitine? Yeah, it actually mixes really well. <laughs> <laughs> That's heavy. Yeah. That's real heavy. I'm trying to think if I dump that first. I think normally I would have put the 15. First. The 15 instead of the 20 kilograms. I well, they don't know if I used to kill them at all. That's heavy. <laughs> yeah. I can't do that. Let's, let's take the these bikes off. Just a little bit of momentum with the seated. We're still controlling it on the way down. And then uh, just a lot more strength on the uh, standing traditional ladder raises. And that's where we got four sets of that. Half of the press is just, that's killer. That is killer. How much rest? What's that? How much rest are we doing? Uh, what we, I would say, with the, the first, because I didn't say it when we were over there, the military were probably close to one, one and a half minutes, two minutes. And then uh, with these, we're probably right at about a minute, yep. roughly. Just just enough for the other person to go and get their set done. Get a pop. And then it's right back into it, yeah. Yeah, I was about to say that's literally my fit. That's my facial expressions watching you do that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's what? No. Yeah, you bust. Yeah, you busted that out. That is heavy. 
picked up the 18s. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done a race with 18s before. <laughs> that was like, I guess you're using a lot more swing. Yeah. And it's kind of like. The way I was picturing it was like more of an upright row kind of thing. Yep, yep. Um, but it still, it didn't feel any impingement at all. Like it actually didn't hurt my shoulders whatsoever. So it felt good, felt safe, happy to go heavy. Um, and then that, I just love reps. Yeah, that's machine drop. So like that was like 20 reps plus five to the side. That felt like Yeah, it had to one up me with the singles. Okay, okay. <laughs> no, that, that was a good set. That was a good set. Smashed it. Yeah, and then the, uh, I like, even that, I don't typically go two at a time. I'll, I'll normally either just alternate or go dual, but the twos got me. Mm. That was hard. Yeah. That was hard. It's, it's, it's the little things, man. Like, you don't need, you don't need much. Even, uh, even mentally, it's sometimes easier. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just to go yeah. two at a time. It's nice. You know? Yeah. Well, it messed with me, because I would, when I counted, I would go one, 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 Same. two. Same. Like, it's yeah, all a mental I'm, game. I'm like, I'm like 20 reps in, I'm at like four. So. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. That was good, though. That was good. That was good. It's mental tricks. you got to trick your mind. Yeah, you do. You do. Let's hope it's not too windy out here um, to record. But, guys, day two, three? I don't know. Um, but today is a, um, it's actually a nice day today. So we hit that session up last night and literally just crashed. Like I, that's why I completely forgot to film anything. Um, we didn't really get up too much, so you didn't miss out on too much. But uh, today I thought I'd bring you guys along as well. We are doing a photo shoot now for EHP. And then um, is the CEO is booked butter, which is butter. It's my <laughs> butter, butter. Butter is my favorite uh, fried chicken burger, like the best fried chicken burger I've ever had. I had it here in, uh, in Sydney, um, and I wanted to go back, but I've been trying to be be good with my diet. So I've been trying to, like, obviously you guys know I'm coming out of a cut, but I'm kind of like just relaxing a little bit now. I'm just done with it. So um, as long as I don't get too crazy, like I've been prepping some meals, but then he's gone and booked this, and it's rude not to. And I'm not a rude person. I like to consider myself a polite man. So uh, yes, yeah, so we're gonna get down there now. Hopefully, smash the shoot out real quick. Uh, because we have fried chicken burgers that are on the menu. And uh, the funny thing about fried chicken burgers is, Murky, I don't know if you know this, but they're not gonna eat themselves. Nah. So uh, we're gonna it. have to intervene and, yep. and make that happen. But um, but I wanna show you guys this, because hopefully it's as good as it was last time. Your attention please, so, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. The testing on the emergency evaculation system is taking we place. Oh, we're gonna evacuate. We're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna get out of here, guys. Hang on, we'll see you soon. <laughs> Probably the best fried chicken burger I've had. Yeah. Is it new pair of shoes? Stop! Oh my god. Hey, how's it, George? Good? Amazing. Yeah. So this is gonna be a pre workout feed. No. That's too sexual. That's <laughs> <laughs> so we made it back to the, the room and um, so far, I'm feeling alright. I haven't needed a food coming yet. I'm just unloading all what we've got from today. <laughs> Merc is just unleashing in the toilet in there. I'm not sure if you guys are hearing that. But it's going, it's going down in there. My stomach's talking to me. Yeah, he's having, he's having a legitimate argument with his stomach. But we are unlo unloading these protein bars as well. Are you losing? 
That's bad. That that chicken's gone straight through him, quite literally. That chicken's flying out. <laughs> this is a good setup from today. We got it. The, oh, more bars. Dude, we have a lot of bars here. I didn't realize we took that many. Um, they all taste so good, by the way. New Oxy Shred grape. This is basically like the same as normal Oxy Shred, but it is a lot stronger. So there's like 250 milligrams of caffeine in here. So it's um, it's hardcore for a reason. So I'm gonna try that today before I just work out, which is good. Um, and what else? Nothing else, I think. I'm gonna sit here, try not to go to sleep. Um, Merck's gonna shoot his brains out for the next hour, and then we're gonna go tear our chest off its bone. So. Let's do it. So we're hitting up a chest workout. We, we didn't die from that food coma. It's actually, I'm actually feeling pretty good after that. I think Murky's taken it out. He's been at the toilet about three times. So he's yeah. emptied himself out. But we've got Murks, Max, George here warming up the titties. Feel good, George? Uh, warm it up here. Feeling good? Great. Uh, I think we should get your chest today. And um, it should be an easy session. Nice and crazy. This gym is sick, by the way. It is uh, the bunker. So I think it's literally brand new. It's like the lighting is mint. Check it. Pre-expo check-in just to get the feels. So, this is day one of the fitness show. We've got three days in total. Murky, how are you feeling? You've never done one before? I'm feeling good. I'm actually yeah? just excited. Yeah. He's excited, which is good. Um, they're always pretty hectic, and I am always like, this, just a little bit nervous before I get in there, just because it's like, you know there's gonna be a lot of people that you speak to, and it's always pretty overwhelming, but as soon as you get in, the vibe's always sick, so you manage to turn it on. Um, Sleep-wise, uh, it's been an upgrade from Hafey, I'm not gonna lie. Um, my video of the snore was like a madman. <laughs> Don't you, Hafey? Yeah, I know you're editing this thinking, f off, but guess what? You do, mate. <laughs> you can edit that out if you want, but if you, if you do, you're fired. Put it that way. Um, but anyway, what I'm saying is that, yeah, last night, I was um, probably like maybe 2 a.m., and he just like kind of choked slash snored in one like movement. Like it was like, a, and it woke me up. And it we disturbed my proof. sleep. We don't have any proof. <laughs> there is no proof. No. I got proof of Hafey snoring, so that's why everyone knows about it. <laughs> so you guys are gonna have to take my word. But um, but he did that, and I wasn't about it. <laughs> I'm just saying, interrupted my sleep. So if I don't if I don't perform today, it's it's I'm blaming Merkel because this guy already is interrupting the circadian rhythms. <laughs> but um, but no, I'm excited, guys. This is day one, so we're gonna get it. I'm not gonna film too much in there because you guys have all seen it. It's the same kind of shit. But you know, I'll try and get some behind the scenes if I see any cool stuff. But anyway. Let's um, let's get it. So just walking into the expo now. This is the EHP booth. So this is probably the best setup I think we've ever had. Here it is. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you why it's the best setup we've ever had. Morning. Morning. How are we all? We're good. So we have the uh, all these different like arenas here, and then the main event. We've got a giant ten foot speaker. So it's actually, it's intimidating um, being next to a taller version of me. Taller, better looking version of me. Um, what are you looking at, man? But that's that. And then we are giving away, I think, 40,000 of these. So guys, that expo is a wrap. Now, my voice is absolutely cooked. I am so tired, because it was like a full three days. Um, uh, but yeah, so I literally got back like 10 minutes ago. It's three o'clock, last day. Merck just went out shopping. Tell you what, that dude has like unlimited energy. Uh, I came back crashing, need to get some food. So I'm just cooking up some um, salmon and veg. And, uh, cause my diet has been like pretty, pretty poor. I mean, I've been, I've been trying, to, trying to be good, but last night I had, had gelato messina. And like that's, for those who don't know, that's like the sickest ice cream in Melbourne and Sydney. So, had to get that done. 
and um, and I just feel like a fat piece of shit now. So um, I really want to cook my food again. So that's what we're doing. Um, and I figured I'd just you know conclude this video where, as I'm doing it to save time and all about that efficiency. So um, I'm gonna peel some snow peas and some green beans and talk to you guys about um, about the expo. So yeah, for those who came down, sick event. Thank you guys for coming down. It's, um, it's always really crazy to, to meet you and, and have chats. Like we all have um, pretty good conversations, so it was um, it was pretty good. I'm really happy with how it turned out as well. So yeah, once again, thanks guys for coming down. Um, but yeah, I am just dead. Like my voice is cooked, as you guys can probably hear. And um, yeah, I'm just I'm a little tired. So I'm I'd like to have a quiet one tonight, but this probably won't happen because we've got like team dinners and stuff. So I'm not going to take you guys with me there. And if you vlog a team dinner with like everyone just drinking and stuff, it just looks a bit funny. So um, that's not happening. But um, this has been a good trip. Like it was cool to catch up with Merck. Never met him, so um, we me and him cooked really well. He's a nice kid. Um, I, it was actually I took it upon myself to introduce him to all the Australian delicacies, and by that I mean lint balls. Can you guys see that? Very nice. Lint. Lint is like my favourite chocolate. That and Kinder Bueno, especially the Lindor balls, like the best. So. We literally stocked up our place with all of my favorite shit food and I had to make him try it all. And he loved it because it's the best. Um, so that was always exciting. And um, but yeah, he's, he like just does not stop. So he's, um, he's loving this. Headed out to Colger Kings now to do some shopping. And I'm like, dude, I couldn't do anything worse than standing right now. This is, look, my legs are like, I'm like crossed. I'm just trying to get enough energy to cook this, this meal right here. But um, but yeah, it was a good weekend, that's all I want to say. It was fun. Um, I hope this video turned out well. It was really hard to film. I kind of just wanted a, a little bit of a break, so I didn't film everything. But I hope you guys enjoy this little uh, this, this little video. And um, and if you made it down, like I said, thank you guys for coming down. I'm, I'm gonna show you what I'm cooking anyway, just so you don't feel left out over there. Um, I'll grab the camera, one sec. So greens there, I'm gonna chop up some capsicum as well, favorite veggie. In here, we've got some, um, oh, that looks nice and burnt. Ah, spring onion and onion with a bit of soy. And in here, cooking, we've got some salmon. Oh my God, that looks great. So that is, um, that is what we're dealing with today. And I'll tell you what, I am just, I am so excited to be able to do nothing. Oh shit, you know what? I, I will be busy as well. Um, I thought I was gonna be like at home for the next month or so. And just chilling, but um, I think I'm up going up to the UK in a couple of weeks now. So that's um, that was like spurred, like last minute. Jim Shark said, "Do you want to come up and do the shoot, organize some like collab videos?" And I was like, "Yes, uh, I do love the UK. I like London. Um, so um, yeah, I'm gonna head back up there, which would be cool. So if any of you guys want to do like another meetup or something, glad to do that. That's sick. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be freezing. So um, and I'll be busy again. So not too much downtime recently, but it is what it is. You can't win them all." Um, but yeah, I'm keen to kind of get home and relax for even if it's just a week because I feel like I'm, my body's just cooked. And like I said, I'm like, I've finished finishing up this cut now. I'm, I'm just over it, like I'm done. So I'm just trying to get healthy, feel healthy, you know. But anyway, guys, that is it for me. I'm going to end this video here. But I did hope you enjoyed this, took something out of it. Maybe uh, how to burn your spring onions and onions. Took that out of it and um, I've done my job. But yeah, yeah, that is it for me, guys. Probably all I wanted to tell you. And um, I guess you know what to do. Burn your onions, stay nice. Got a fresh cut in the denims, all these sexy jeans in my section. Slide into your DMs in the PM and the AM. Then I slide into your feelings when you see just what I'm saying.